Hello everyone, welcome to Maths IAC. This is a reacting mass calculation. This is a very popular question that you get in your GCSE exams in Edexcel, AQA, OCR, all exam boards and also IGCSE exams too. Please pause the video and give this a try. When you want to check the answer, press play. Magnesium reacts with hydrochloric acid to form magnesium chloride and hydrogen gas. Yes, you can see that. And the equation has been balanced for you. You can clearly see that one magnesium, one magnesium, two hydrogens, two hydrogens, two chlorines, two chlorines, all good. A student reacts 4.8 grams of magnesium with excess hydrochloric acid. Okay. Now, Questions like this, we always need to start with the one that we already know. In this example, that will be magnesium. So, we know the mass is 4.8 grams. But we need to find the number of moles. But remember, the formula is number of moles is mass over atomic mass. Mass is 4.8 divided by AR of magnesium is given here, or you can use the periodic table in the exam usually. So we get 4.8 divided by 24. So we know this one here is 0.2 moles. Calculate the mass of magnesium chloride that can be formed. Okay, right. So the question is the mass here. Now, before we find the mass, we need to find the number of moles. So how do we do that? We need to look at the molar ratio. Now, magnesium is 1, magnesium chloride is 1, because if there's no number at the front, that means it's 1. It's like 1x is the same as x. So we can clearly see the molar ratio is 1 is to 1. So when you have 0 0.2 moles of magnesium, obviously, you can definitely tell the number of moles of magnesium chloride formed will also be 0 0.2 moles. Now, number of moles is mass over molar mass, MR, because this is a compound. So number of moles is 0 0.2 mass, I don't know, M. MR is the molar mass. Now let's find that. Magnesium is 24 plus Cl2. Chlorine is 35.5, but I have two of them. Okay. So 35.5 times by 2. So the sum here is 71 at 24, which is 95. Now we can substitute it here. Now we need to find the mass. Obviously move 95 to this side. So it's 0 0.2 multiplied by 95 is the mass. So we get the answer as 19 grams. Final answer. 